Hi, I'm Jameson Clark. I'm the site director of the Queen Elizabeth. Hi, I'm Nicole Joseph. I'm the site admin at the Queen Elizabeth. So my name is Sean Arunza. I'm a second year resident in family medicine um, and I'm at the Queen Elizabeth. I got to family medicine uh, through a bit of a, a different path. Um, I started off as an engineer and then when I finished engineering, I had the opportunity to start a company. So we made a stroke rehabilitation company. Uh, basically we made games that people could play at home to do their rehab for strokes. Through that company, I got interested in medicine. I thought, you know, strokes are very interesting, but what else is there that I could, that I could help, that I could work on? Um, and then I decided I wanted to be a family doctor so I could bring innovation to family medicine. Let me know if you see anything. No, nope, I don't see anything. Okay, why don't you switch to the blue light now and scan again and tell me if there's any foreign bodies. Well, the cleaning is unique in several ways, but what we're best known for is our urgent care. This is where we have a very unique and uh, progressive model of healthcare system delivery, where we get to do a lot more procedures, we get to do a lot more quick access to patients, uh, almost like a mini emergency, but for the community, uh, utilizing uh, family physicians. And we don't see that in many places. It's unique to Quebec and one of the first places uh, in Canada. Hi, my name is Asmin Wang. I'm a second year family medicine resident at the Queen Elizabeth. The small site really allows us to have one-on-one -on -one interaction with the staff. Uh, you really feel like your teaching is personalized instead of just being a resident um, in a group, big group of people. So pe everyone knows your name here. Uh, it really feels like coming home. So Nicole, she is uh, everything to us. She plays many roles. Uh, she is a, our site administrator and she creates this vibe where it's like um, we're a little family. We're four residents each year, uh, so eight in total. So having her here to help us all with everything is, is one of the best things about the site. Because we're a smaller site, we tend to take a very hands-on approach of one-on-one. -on -one. This means that in the first couple months of the, the uh, residence training program, myself and the teachers take a very in-depth, personal approach to the residents, getting to know them to understand their strengths and weaknesses early, personality types. In this way, we're actually able to guide them and to create a very tailored, um, customizable learning program, identifying the strengths and, thing and weaknesses they may need to address early in their career so they can be successful later. My name is Karen Deep Birdie. I'm a family physician at the Queen Elizabeth Health Complex, I'm affiliated with McGill. So we actually have been really, really fortunate at our site that we've managed to have some of the students that have joined us join us as residents. So we actually have one who's a PGY2 now, as well as one that's a PGY1, actually two in our PGY2 year that actually came through as clerks, um, which I think really tells the strength of our program. We have wonderful family doctors here um, who really love what they do and they are really really keen to pass it on. I have to say even as a supervisor it's been wonderful for me because they challenge us as well especially as they go into their PGY two years. Um, the amount of knowledge that they have is pretty fantastic um, and the questions that they ask and the situations that come up challenge us too and it helps me to become a better physician. So it's been it's been really a pleasure to work with them. So I decided early on in medical school that I wanted to be a family doctor. In the future, I intend on having a practice that includes community pediatrics, I want to do some palliative care medicine, I want to do some rehabilitation medicine, um, and all those things are possible within family medicine. The thing about family medicine which other people don't have is patients come in totally undifferentiated. So they come in with a few symptoms and you don't know what the diagnosis is. It's our job to come up with that diagnosis. Or if we're not sure, we can ask for help. But whenever any other doctor sees a patient, they've already been seen by a family doctor. So a good family doctor can make a very big difference. We wish you good luck on CARMS. And we look forward to meeting you.